Well, my name is Kelsey, and um, I just sort of met Artie in passing at the horse shows. I bought a couple things from her, and you know, we really hit it off and kind of became friends from there. So mm -hmm. that's, that's kind of how we met. And do, you, do you show together, or you met her in the booth? Um, no, I met her um, at the horse show in Ottawa, and. Um, um, you know, Artie's kind of been more Ottawa slash Montreal based and um, uh, after I spent uh, four years riding um, out in BC when I came back home to Toronto, I met Artie at the Ottawa Horse Show and um, she actually recently started carrying um, some belt hiking, which is a... Oh, you're one of the kind of, artisans. Um, yeah, I guess if you want to use that word. Um, I've been making um, uh, horse show belts out of, um, out of ribbons and now you're saying ribbons, is that horse show ribbons? Yeah, horse show oh, ribbons. So you, you take their winning ribbons and you make a belt for them? Yeah, a lot of what I have in um, Artie's store right now is, um, it's, you know, they're ribbons that my sister and I have won um, mm -hmm. or, you know, friends have given them to me just because they want to clear out. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I've... Uh, and you know, I mean, there are some ribbons that are very special. Like I have, you know, my first CET win, or you know, the last class I did with um, my old high junior M horse, who's now retired. You know, like some of the special ones you keep on the wall. I wonder if maybe we could bring a couple of the belts out yeah, and have sure. a look at them. Yeah. Well, these are some of the stock ones I've made, and um, you know, again, it's completely customizable with the custom options. You know, most people give me their own ribbons to make a sort of souvenir out of it. Um, I have a whole bunch of different patterns, um, you know, again, and um, it is it is something that's sort of geared towards the more pony crowd, um, I, you know, the flamingos are really super fun, um, you know, with pink ribbons and a hot pink trim, um, the red one with the, uh, the kisses and the uh, first place Canadian ribbons, I know in the States, blue is the winner, but back home. Red's a win, and in honor of St. Patrick's Day, I thought I'd bust out this one with the shamrocks, but um, I recently bought some new ribbons uh, that have more, um, sort of more intricate designs with some paisley and some sort of texture, textured geometric patterns, but um, you know, I do my best to take pictures of everything I have and I put it on my Facebook page or um, my online website. Just it's, you know, just so people can see how I'm always changing and trying to put something new out there. Um, and you can also find us on Facebook, and there are also links through Artie's website. So that's the ribbon side of the belts, and then uh, on the other side we have shamrocks and kisses and flamingos. Now, do you do anything other than belts? I work with my friend Francesca, who um, she makes uh, bows and accessories. She has her own line called Frankie Accessories. And um, you, through a special order, we will make um, a matching bow and belt set for uh, for the pony kids in the crowd. So we've, we've done a couple of those so far. Um, and, you know, I think they're just the sweetest things ever. Oh, they're very cute, yes. Yeah, it's, you know, it's adorable on the little pony. I do a small kids, a kids, small, medium, large, and I've also just started offering them in a two inch width as well as the inch and a half. Mm -hmm. Just, you know, a lot of the newer breeches have a, a wider belt loop, so I yeah. think with the wider belt it just looks that much better. Alright, well thank you very much. Yeah, it's been no, a pleasure thank talking you. to you.